Okay, so here's the uh, original strategy tester assistant. I made a few little modifications this weekend just to uh, spice it up. I don't, uh, I don't believe in automatic trading, but um, I do like doing this kind of thing just for fun, more of a game. So uh, what I did here was uh, I just uh, added a few lines of code so that it would uh, buy and sell randomly. Um, yeah, so that's about it. So all I'm doing is uh, watching my account profit and uh, taking profit as need be. I'm doing pretty well so far with uh, 13 a little over $1300 average daily profit um, an average of 14, a little over 14 orders before I close, and an average of 8 lots before I close. Here's my account balance down there. Hope everybody's trading is going well out there. I had a pretty good week for me. Made about 3% of my account this week. Whenever I get a big drawdown like this, I'll just turn on the automatic profit, desired profit, just so I don't um, just so I don't miss an opportunity to close all this. Because we're in the danger zone now.
There we go. I'll turn that off again. I'm going to check something here. Here's the my slither game. So zebforex.ca if you're interested in any of my robots. Uh, let's see if I got it here. <clears throat> Zeb So here's my little website if you're interested in any of my robots. The one I really think you should should be interested in is the original strategy tester assistant, which isn't an EA as much as a practicing tool designed to be used with MT4. So you can go through all that and uh, just leave me your contact information and I will send you some uh, the information you want or uh, an invoice if you'd like to buy it. Here's some comments from other people here. I'm happy with the positive comments. And of course, my favorite game, Slither. Mm. Mm. If you're not familiar with the original strategy tester, some of the features, you can uh, turn the automatic take profit on here. And this can be changed in the settings. Uh, it displays uh, your open orders, how many lots you got and how many lots uh, you have per buy and per sell. You can use the uh, per candle feature, which uh, if you turn that on, it'll pause the uh, strategy tester. Maybe I disabled that. Huh. So you got the uh, pending buy and sell, which will invoke the uh, per candle feature. I must have messed this per candle feature up when I was adding the code for my for my automatic buy sell anyway normally that'll just stop it after each candle with the original strategy tester no nope, but if i put a sell stop loss then it'll work huh. and you also got the uh, pending sell Pending cell will in invoke the uh, per candle feature as well. Anyway, enough of that. There's other videos that explain the strategy tester assistant. Check those out.
This drummer's getting a little monotonous, isn't it? I'd put some good music on for you, but then YouTube always flags me. Here, I'll give a plug to another YouTuber. Um, here's the drums I use, Wiki Loops. Turn that off. And uh, here's my favorite uh, YouTube channel. This is a bass player here, it's pretty good. guy plays awesome bass. <laughs> He's got a repertoire of what seems like unlimited songs. And his music selection is uh, to my liking. Very nice. Well, I guess I'll wrap this up. You get the idea. So the original strategy tester is a great way to uh, practice on the weekends, keep your head in the game. Um, I normally don't sell the ones that I have automatic uh, trading on, but if you wanted one, just let me know. And I'll make an exception for you. I'm going to put the automatic close on. Alright, thanks for watching. Have a great day. Happy trading. <laughs>